is Olga Kotelnikova and I'm sitting here with Jen Jennifer Harmon, Poker Hall of Fame and inductee, and she's also twice World Poker Series bracelet winner. So Jennifer, tell us a little bit about how did you get into poker? Well, my whole family would play games. And when I was eight years old, my mom started teaching me poker. And she would deal to us to make sure that we played the game right. And I'm very competitive in nature. I was in gymnastics and, and other things and very competitive. And I loved the game. And a friend of my father's used to go down to the casinos and play. So by the time I was 16, I actually snuck into the casinos and played. My first hand of poker was at one and three dollars, seven card stud high. And then there was this big table of uh, them playing a different game and I was very curious and it was actually Texas Hold'em. So the next day I came in, I just jumped into that game and then played Texas Hold'em for a very, very, very long time until um, I put myself through college playing poker and then I moved to Los Angeles and decided to play poker. But I really wasn't going to play poker. I was just going to play until I figured out what I wanted to do. But every time I walked into the club, I just felt I'm home. So I remember playing 3060 Limit Hold'em, and I'm seeing this three and six hundred dollar game that's like was a really big game. And I'm like, I'm going to be playing in that game. So I worked at my game, I just, year after year, I just got better and better and then ended up playing in that game. And then ended up playing higher and higher and higher and higher. Because with poker you're always having to work on your game because things change. And poker evolves and you always have to be on top of your game to be able to be a winning, uh, winning poker player. Great. So tell us also about your twice bracelet owner for the World Poker Series. And I, you know, I know a lot of people would love to have one bracelet. How did it feel? Was it like greatest, greatest accomplishment? Well, always to win a World Series of Poker bracelet is a great accomplishment. And I'm happy, I'm happy I have one and I have two. Uh, the first time I ever won a bracelet was in a game I never played before in my life. And it was deuce to seven, no limit, never took a hand of it before ever. Oh, wow. So I called a friend over and said, you know, quick, give me some lessons. And he gave me the sheet of paper with what to play, what hands to play in certain um, positions. So I looked over it really quick and jumped in and ended up winning the tournament like awesome. 12 hours later. and. You know, I got to the final table and I kept saying, okay, being at the final table is great. Then I got down to like fourth place. I said, oh, fourth place would be good. Then I got down to heads up and I'm like, no, second is no good. I want to win this thing. And I ended up winning it. And that's you what did it. was one of the biggest accomplishments I ever, I ever did in poker. And yeah, I was ecstatic. Jennifer, we also heard about your charity work. And would you please tell us a little bit more about? Well. I do a lot of work with animals. I, ever since I was a kid, when I would watch TV, I'd always root for the animals. <laughs> and I am just have a huge part of my heart that wants to help animals. So I connected with the Nevada SPCA about 10 years ago, maybe. Oh. And I do a poker charity event for them once a year to raise money. The Nevada SPCA is a, it's a no-kill animal shelter and they try to save all of them. And all the money in my charity event goes towards the animals and towards saving them. And it's just an amazing, amazing charity to be involved in. And they save thousands of animals a year. And I will con continue to do it. I will be their spokesperson. I'll do whatever it takes to help dogs, cats, pigs, rabbits, birds, whatever whatever they get involved in. Once a, um, a llama. But um, I'm, I'm extremely happy to be involved with them. And I'm also involved with creating donor, um, creating donor awareness because okay. I have two kidney transplants. Oh, wow. And I want 
people to understand that giving an organ, you know, that it saves people's lives. And I was very, very sick at one point, and then after I had the kidney, I was perfect, like no sickness anymore. And I would love people to consider Donate. saving people's lives because it really does. There's right. a long list of people waiting for organs, and a lot die on the list waiting. So I, I promote. I promote that too, organ donor awareness. Awesome. Jennifer, it's so great what you do. Do you have any more future plans for your charities? Well, what I want to do is I want to involve Breakout Gaming to support my charities. Right now I'm encouraging my teammates to actually get involved with my charity and do other charities to support other things. I think charity work is very important and I think Breakout Gaming is a great vehicle to help other people. That's awesome. So also you play online gaming, correct? Well, right now online gaming in the U.S. is sketchy. Um, you know, they have a few sites going in, but um, I'm, I'm thinking, you know, with Breakout Gaming that it's going to be Help, help it's going to be a gaming. cool site to play on because you're actually playing with um, um, cryptocurrency and you're not playing with real money. And I think it's a, just a really cool concept. And I think, I believe that people are going to enjoy it and, and play poker. And also it's expanding and you can basically play many things. You can play chess and checkers and backgammon and and you know board games and these things and I think it's going to catch on and people are going to really enjoy playing on breakout gaming mm -hmm. and also you purchase one of those coins breakout coins correct yes and where are you planning to use in those well <laughs> you know they they have a deal in place with gamers which which you can play people all over the world so, you know, I have a few friends in London that like to play FIFA 2016 and, mm -hmm. and different games. And I would love to beat my friends in those kind of games. I of think course. that would be really cool. A lot I'm of fun. I'm sure you will. So I think the whole site is going to be fun. They, they're going to offer everything eventually, and it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a blast. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, and good luck to you. Thank you very much. Hopefully thank you, you for having me. Hopefully you can win a third one. <laughs> And this is was a Jennifer Harmon and I'm Olga Kotelnikova.